What's up? Hey. I was just saying, hey, because I thought, what's up? How you doing? I'm doing well. Okay. Hold on. Let me minutes. check this out. Every time I see you, you're always dressed so nice. <laughs> what do you got going on? How you doing? Good. I just had dinner. I'm going to just go meet a friend for a drink. Nice. You know, now, I'm speaking of dinner, that's a good thing that you brought up. So I was having a discussion with a friend of mine. You know, it's 2016. And, you know, nowadays, girl, women, women power, all that. You know, pup, what, what was those girls, the Spice Girls stuff and all that? Here's what I want to know. Is it ever okay for the woman to pay for the first date? I mean, I, I the way I was raised and just like to set the precedent, right. I think that... Um, I'm not saying I could do that, I'm just curious if... I, I just, for the first date, I think that a guy should do that, um, unless like the circumstances were <laughs> something that they couldn't, right. but I definitely think that, you know... But, a girl can chip in here and there, and it's not a big deal. Is so. it proper for the girl to do the fake, well, what's what's my part, or to reach into the purse at least? I mean, you're, we're also in Los Angeles, so you're not going to find that many girls in Los Angeles that <laughs> don't expect for the meal to be right. paid. I think it's but if proper. you're maybe in like Alabama or something like that, then maybe like you split the bills, you right. split everything, so it would be different. So <laughs> it's kind of hard for me to answer that question. Right, right. I just kind of like, you know, because you say you're meeting a friend, I'm like, well, well, you know, is, is, is this a date that you're going on or just like a... Oh, no. I'm okay. Just, I'm, yeah, I just got out of a long relationship, so we're not going there. Okay, right <laughs> now you're just doing you. <laughs> yeah, just <I'm>, me. <laughs> There's just nothing wrong with that. Still dealing with, like, a divorce, basically. <laughs> oh, so, you know yeah. what? That, that I you know, uh, it's never easy, and it's never fun, but it's like it has to happen, and especially if you two have, like, uh, things that you shared and, you know, split. Everything's and, intertwined, so right. it doesn't, it's not like an overnight thing, so. Right. Yeah. I'm going to move this way because the guy's been really weird behind you. Okay. But, <laughs> no, no, not, he's not next to you. He's just uh, being a crazy homeless guy. Right. But anyways, okay, one last question. This is really funny to me. Did you see the Olympic pole vaulter, Asian, who jumped over a pole and he lost because his penis hit the pole? <laughs> What? You need to go immediately and look this up. I have not seen this. Yes. So, I have not seen uh, this. It's everywhere. You need to I've see been, it and like, you will laugh her. Wow. <laughs> I, so, it got, so it was so, so okay, so, it got in the way. Well, you know, well, he was Asian. And uh, which uh, I don't know what that means. I don't, I'm just saying. But uh, it, his he paintbrush. But uh, he, he jumps over the pole and he, he's about to win gold. Okay. But then you see the penis like move because he hits the like, pole. You can see it. Like, you can see you can like see as it. if like you don't see you don't you don't, you don't see like, that you don't like see you the action. Right, right. The speedo. You see. Well, what's the speedo? And so, if you haven't seen, okay, you haven't seen it. I was gonna say you wanted to make I mean, fun of him. Don't think that shit like tucked in or something like and that. He did like not a tuck cup it in. No, no cup. You can tell this is all pure penis. I mean, <laughs> somebody should have warned him beforehand. Like, yes. these are like, this is how you do it. You hey. gotta wear a cup or something. Come on now. You're, you're an Olympic athlete. So right. Let's get with the program. And don't lose gold because of your penis. Yeah, I mean, I guess. You don't want to lose by an inch. Oh, yeah, I guess if you're gonna lose, though, right. that might be a good way to lose. It's and a it funny just story. Too big, yes, you know, it's just, sorry. It's like, what I gotta do with this 10 inch or. Like, sorry, I just uh, won a Nobel right. Prize, but uh, for nothing. You know? penis. So, what you okay, do? listen, go home and watch it. You will crack up. Or even when you I'm go into the like, restaurant, go look, look it up. Right yes, go check it, out. check it out. Listen, it's always a pleasure talking to you. You look great. I'm glad to see you. I know all that other drama's going on, but you're doing good. We love you. You're doing big things. That's yeah. what's up. I can't wait to meet your new guy when you start dating. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> uh, uh, all right, have a good one. All right.